Hi everyone, my name is Talia and I'll be talking about the convention made in Asia and I just got back home from that convention and they have a really cool poster so I'm glad that I have one of those and it was a really fun experience it was the first time I went there it's pretty big as well and it's just an awesome atmosphere although there were a lot of people but I went on a Sunday so apparently on Saturday it was crazy busy and it wasn't really you know nice to walk around there because of annoying people <laughs> and just too much people so I'm kind of glad that I went on a Sunday but I am hoping that next year I can go on the Saturday and a Sunday because then I can film more for you guys and today I just really couldn't because I just wanted to see everything and that took a lot of time. I did film some stuff but that's mostly just merchandise and <laughs> that's basically it so I will show you that now. Like I said, it's not much, so I'm gonna try to do my best next year because I really want to go. And yeah, I will just show you what I got from the convention, which is a lot again, you know me. I actually didn't... Mm, wait, when did I buy Hisoka? Like two months ago and I actually got it like a month later or something. So for two months I didn't buy anything anime or manga related. So all that money went into the convention so I could spend it there. So I did have a lot to buy, so um, I will show you what I got. Uh, also, I bought two awesome bags that I put my merch in. So I have this one from Sabre and then I have this one with Levi on it. So I really like these bags. I'm really gonna use them <laughs> later on as well just to do like little shopping and stuff like I don't care what people think but I'm gonna use these bags and I'm in love with them you could actually buy them for like 10 euros but the thing is with each of these bags you got like five posters and like a fan thingy or like a pin or something else I still need to check like what was in the fate bag thing is from fate zero bag there was nothing fate related in there and it was all date alive stuff you know how i think about date alive i do like the first season but the second season is a bit meh kind of fucked it up so i'm not the biggest fan of date alive so what i was thinking is i might just leave the date alive merch on the side and maybe give it away later on youtube or something here for I don't know, maybe a mini contest and just gather up some merch and I can give it away to someone. That would be cool and, you know, I can do something back for you guys as well. So, because I'm talking about that, I will show you what was in the bags. So, this was in the Levi bag. So, it's a, a poster and a fan and a pin of... Chibi Fox Levi, <laughs> which is pretty cute. I didn't see the posters yet, so I'm gonna do that now. So this is the fan thingy. I already bought one at Facts of Madoka Magica, but I'm kind of glad I have a Levi one now. The pin is here. Oh, that's really cute. No idea where I will put it though, but this is a Chibi. It's really cool. I like it. And then we have the poster. So, 
Poster one is just a normal Attack on Titan poster. And second one, I like this one. This one is Mikasa. I like it. I like the paper, how, how it is printed and all that stuff as well. Oh, this is a fun one. <laughs> this one is in there as well. Oh, I like that one the most. <laughs> it's Mikasa and Levi. And it looks like this. So yeah, those are the posters that are in there. So that's cool. Okay. Let's check out the other bag, which is not Fate Zero, but Day the Life. So that was in the other one. Um, no idea what this is. I guess I'll figure it out soon. And we have a pin of Yoshino, which I do like. I do like her character. So And Kurumi I like as well. So yeah, let's see what kind of posters are in there. And then I'll put it away safely. Alright, so this is the plastic thingy. I'm guessing that is for your door. To put it on your... Hang it on your door or something. Um, Yeah. No idea. But it's really hard plastic. So it's good quality. Now we have the poster. So to be honest, I don't really like this first one. Um... Probably because of the fan service that is in the picture. I know that series is kind of like fan servicey as well, but you know, I'm sure they'll have better posters. Yeah, like this one. I like this one. Always liked her. She's a cool one. Yeah, Yoshino. This is actually a cool one as well. I like this one too. And last one is forgot her name although she is to Toka no yeah I don't know although she's like the main next to the main character so yeah that one is cool as well actually so yeah I will put that away and I'm not gonna keep these so I will be giving those away later on um when I get a lot of stuff together and then I can do a big giveaway or something when I have I don't know 3,000, 4,000 subs, maybe. Um, so yeah, I can do that. <laughs> that sounds like fun. Next thing that I got, and actually the first thing that I got. Um, oh wait, no. Was that the first thing? The first thing that I got was this <laughs> sweater, actually. I bought this sweater there as well, because I was cold and I didn't bring a sweater with me. And I was like, oh, this is cool. And it actually kind of fits my outfit as well, because I don't know if you can see it, but I'm wearing like the sailor... Um, thingies you know <laughs> so yeah I'm wearing that and I was like huh that kind of fits so I'll buy it and it looks cool as well and it's really warm so I'm happy that I bought it so after that I bought these not postcards but they're like just like little pictures and I really love them they're only 50 cents for one so can't go wrong with that and I'm gonna try to like frame all of them together and I think that will be really cool <laughs> so yeah haikyuu I have another haikyuu <laughs> they didn't have much of haikyuu at all so I was like I'm gonna get this <laughs> kuroko no basuke this is all fan art by the way and it's drawn very cute and smooth and it just looks very good so another kuroko Levi, Mikasa, I really like this one. Also, they're all printed on like photo paper, so it's really shiny. And Ben from Nanatsu no Taizai, nothing from Nanatsu no Taizai there, except for like fan art, so that was kind of disappointing as well, but you know, it's still going on the series, so yeah, we'll see. <laughs> Meliodas from Nanatsu no Taizai. Diane, although I think her head is a little bit too big on this picture, I still like it. Then Nurarihyon. <clears throat> Claymore. Not much of Claymore either. <laughs> so, uh, Film and Alchemist, I found like little ones, so I was really happy about that. So this one. Mustang. Envy. 
and this one is from Bakuman. So I like this one as well. <laughs> it just looks so groovy in it. So I'll, I love it. So yeah, all of these were very cheap. So I bought loads of them and I'm just going to frame them and I think it will look pretty cool. So yeah, looking forward to that. Okay, next thing I got, um, I bought two DVD boxes. So I want to show you that real quick. And they were pretty cheap as well. I saw a lot of DVD boxes that I wanted to buy. I saw the original Hunter x Hunter, like everything. But it was subtitled in French, so I was like, nope. So that was the problem with this convention, though. A lot of people speak French there. Brussels is like the kind of like French part of uh, Belgium. They speak French and Dutch, but most of them speak French alone. So whenever I was trying to talk to these people, they either wanted to talk French or English. But when I when I spoke English, they couldn't really understand me all the time. So it was kind of annoying. But otherwise, like for merch and stuff, it's perfect. But for DVDs and manga, it's really hard to find Dutch or English stuff. So for that, it kind of sucks. For that, I prefer facts because that's more... Well, everything is Dutch and English. So I do prefer facts for that kind of stuff. But for merch, this one is fine. So for DVDs... I got, there's actually one stand there that's called Arjonia. I buy stuff from them online as well. So I was glad that they were there and that's actually all English. So I was happy to see that. So what I bought from them is welcome to the NHK. I always wanted to see this series and it was only 25 euros for 24 episodes. So it's everything. And I'm really looking forward to start watching this because I've always wanted to see it and I've heard it so good. So... Yes, this is the first one. Next one is Cowboy Bebop. I've never seen this one either. And it is, it's supposed to be like, um, not a masterpiece. Oh, I don't know, because I haven't seen it. But it's just one of the classics that you kind of have to see. So I'm glad that I got this. I'm kind of sure that I will like it as well. So yeah, it was cheap. It was 15 euros for everything. So, and it has a really cool box as well. And... Next, I'm going to show you my figures, so I'm gonna unpack them as well, so or unbox them. So that's gonna be interesting. So I got Bisky, my favorite girl from Hunter x Hunter right now, but that could still change, but still a lot of respect for this girl. I really like her. So I got this one. This one was 25 euros, which I think was still a, not pricey, but like... For the figure itself, it's not that big, so I, I guess it's okay. I can't complain, really. So, um, yeah, 25 euros. It's also a bon presto, like the other ones. So it should fit with the other one. So that's cool. Um, let's see. So her pigtails. And yeah, that's all separate. So... I'll just build her now and then come back. All right, so Bisky is one piece. <laughs> so uh, we have this. So it's a little bit different than the other ones that I have from Hunter x Hunter. That are also from Van Presto, but it's like another series. This one, I believe, is from the original Hunter x Hunter. The other ones are from 2011, I think. Actually, I'm no, I'm not too sure. <laughs> Anyways, but... Um, you know, this is Bisky. Looks very good for, you know, the price I paid. So she's uh, really small, of course. So no idea how she will look next to Gon. I kind of hope that it's going to be like accurate. Why can't I not? It's, it's the other way, isn't it? Yep, it's the other way. <laughs> okay. So this is her on her stand. That looks good. So next to Gon, she should be a little bit bigger, I think, than Gon. Or the same. That actually makes sense. I think... I'm not too sure right now, but, you know, looks good. I'm happy with her. So this is the first figure I got. And the next one that I got is Mikasa. So actually the one that I wanted, uh, you know the story from facts. I asked for Mikasa as well for this one. But I got Eren instead. So now I have Levi, Eren, and Mikasa. So 
let's get her out of the box it was actually the same price as it was on facts so you know can go wrong with that this is her out of the box and now out of the plastic <laughs> should have brought my scissors damn it all right got my scissors so let's continue this it makes so much noise uh, anyways i'm happy that i have this one now since uh the mikasa and the Aaron are well they have like the same stand um and the background and all that stuff and like the extra stuff on the figure is the same as well so it fits perfectly and i'm happy to have both of them actually i don't mind as much anymore that i have Aaron because i have mikasa and levi to back him up all right so this is the base and then and this is the figure she looks very badass in here <laughs> i like it and then we have you know like the the knives the swords that are very tiny and kind of uh not difficult but a bit annoying to get just in here it's really tiny so um maybe i will glue it later on i'm not too sure but it has to be on it so uh let's adjust her to the base i like this pose way more than the one i have for erin although that one is cool as well so and go in here and here come on girl help me what is it is this how it oh okay oh she has a okay 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 i'm following anyways this is how the figure looks imagine it with the swords here i will put them in later because i don't want to bore you guys with that so this is the figure so i'm really happy with it i like how she looks as well she's like i don't give a fuck and like i said it fits with the other one so the other one is this one that i bought at facts so, ugh. <laughs> there we go. Now I have to find space. Ugh, why? Our figure so addicting. Yeah, okay. Found something. I'll change that up later. <laughs> Anyways, those are the figures that I got. Next up is lots of posters. So I'm just warning you right now. <laughs> it's all posters, I think. Oh, wait, no. <clears throat> One thing that's not a poster is a Pokemon deck. So I bought this um, hard gold and silver um, deck. And I've never seen those before actually. But um, I don't know. Apparently the trading card game online didn't exist yet. Because there's no cards in here with the codes. So yeah, I'm not really used to that anymore. I was like, where's my card? Where's my code to play online? But um, it's cool. It's like Royal Guard uh, team deck and it's a needle queen one. And you know, it's it's really cool. I already opened that up, so blue. But I will try to play that deck later. And I just want to see how it works because there's like some good cards in there. So um, yeah, excited about that then. Okay, let's just start with the posters. <laughs> I'll go over this really quickly if I can and just throw them on my bed. Um, oh, right. I finally found some Full Metal Alchemist posters, which I'm happy about. So, it's, uh, they are little ones, but, you know, it's, it's better than nothing. Because there wasn't anything Full Metal Alchemist related other than, like, pillows again. And no figures at all. <laughs> Didn't see any. Uh, manga there was in DVDs, but you know, I, I have that stuff. So poster one all of the sins Two Mustang and Edward. I really like this one <laughs> and then three This one I like it Those are like posters that I got for 10 euros three for 10 euros. So, you know, that is like nothing so <laughs> next ones are here i don't know which ones these are 
we'll see. Oh yeah, that's yeah, <laughs> that's artwork as well. So I really liked it. Um, I have Kuroko no Basuke. Then another from Metal Alchemist. I have my husband. Here's the Edward, lovely Edward. I like this artwork a lot. So yeah, that's him. And then another Edward that I like as well. With like his stone. So I like that. And like this too. And his face is so awesome. It's gorgeous. <laughs> and then Hunter x Hunter one. Because, you know, there's barely anything Hunter x Hunter. So I was like, yes, I'm going to get this. Especially because Hisoka is on it. And Illumi is on it as well. So... Normally you only see these four and I'm happy that these two are on it as well. So that's cool. Those are also like four posters for 10 euros. So again, almost nothing. Next, I probably spent most on posters. I don't know actually. This is an amazing artist that I saw. I actually have her card here somewhere. Um, but I will probably buy from her like online and stuff because her posters are so beautiful and cute and I really like her artwork and the first one that I picked from her is Barakamon I was uh, I was so happy to see Barakamon I saw this poster and I was like oh my god this gives me such happy feels I want to see the series again so I'm happy I have this one next one by her is like this how awesome is that Haikyuu and Kuroko I really like this one. <laughs> I was a bit quiet staring at it. But yeah, I really like it. So I have this one. And then <laughs> I like this one as well. Neon Genesis Evangelion. I like it a lot. I like this artist a lot. So like I said, I will put her name here and in the description and all that. Also for the other artists, but I'm not too sure if I have like a card with me or something so i will look that up next one and last one yeah <laughs> so last ones are two hendrix hunter posters because like i said those were the only things they had of hendrix hunter the biscuit figure they had one of uh, the dodgeball guy from greed island forgot his name right now and they had a they had an awesome kurapika one from like uh, York New City with like the red scarlet eyes really wanted to buy that one but I didn't have any money anymore and I was like oh and I was like oh no I'm gonna have like two kurapikas but that's all right but no not enough money <laughs> so that kind of sucked but anyways also talking about figures I was almost gonna buy a kurama figure from Yu Yu Hakusho but when I asked how much it was, it was 35 euros, but it was like a good size. So I was like, okay, can I see it please? And I saw it and then I saw that the Rose Whip was broken and they didn't seem like people who wanted to get less money for it. So I was like, okay, never mind. <laughs> Anyways, I'm going to show you the posters. <laughs> so I have this one, Kilowa and Gone really like this one since i don't have much merch of hunter x hunter that actually involves kilowa except for now posters and that kind of sucks because i really want a uh, figure of kilowa me okay next one is this one i really like this one because this is the york new city arc with the phantom troop and hisoka and it's i like it a lot <laughs> So yeah, that's that. That is all I got from the convention. <laughs> and like I said, it is enough. I have so many posters and I wanted to buy so many more because I saw a lot of like Kuroko and free posters and so like Steins Gate and Attack on Titan. But I was like, okay, Attack on Titan, um, Steins Gate, I have one. But I mean, Attack on Titan, free and Kuroko. I already have enough posters of that. Although I was like, nah, it's never enough. I can still buy more. But I was like, okay, gonna wait till next facts convention or another convention. And then I will buy my Kuroko and free kind of stuff again, but in small amounts and not like as much as last time. So yeah. Anyways, 
all these posters i'm gonna have to change everything up um here as well so i might there's probably gonna be some posters that will be added and it will be very full so <laughs> I have no idea yet how I'm gonna fix this. Same with my figures, I don't know where to put them, because... <sighs> and then I'm looking at my DVDs, <laughs> okay, I can go on about this. Anyways, that is it for this haul, I hope you enjoyed this video, and let me know what you thought of all of this stuff. <laughs> um, I don't want I don't want to show off, but uh, you know, I'm, I'm kind of happy that I have all of this stuff, <laughs> so I'm ready to watch Cowboy Bebop and welcome to the NHK. But, um, you know, first I gotta finish some other stuff. So, yeah, anyways, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up. And I will be back later. Bye.